students uh, this is a video uh, to show you how how many types of submission do we have on Moodle and how to confirm uh, your assignment has been submitted no matter what type of a submission it is so now I've prepared the three types of submission for you um, uh, tutorial uh, video now um, critical thinking now so I have assignment activity test tutorial the first type is that there is no submission uh, button you just have to add your assignment and the assignment will be sent so the first one I'll click on this one I'll open the first assignment to submit my assignment so always uh, to confirm whether or not you have submitted your assignment you go to submission status so no attempt that's why and the other and the rest is the other details like uh, if it is graded or not what is the due date when is it will be over and it will be closed time remaining and last modify so now I will go to add submission this is an online text I can answer via online text or upload a file translate this text for example uh, so I'll submit my assignment and then I'll go to the bottom save changes and now submission status submitted for grading so this is the first type of submission it requires no submitting button and uh, not clicking on any uh, submission status so simple like that submission status submitted for grading why do we have this option still because the closing date the due date is still 21st of May so I can always go change my uh, answer and resubmit it it's all okay you have been allowed by the teacher so this is the first type of submission that requires uh, just to uh, write the text or upload the file and the, sub the, the, the assignment will be submitted what about the second type so activity 2 tutorial for example we'll go to that one the second one that requires submission button to be clicked upon to uh, to click on it and then to be sent so first again submission status no attempt nothing yet that's why I have to go to add submission uh, for example, uh, write the review of topic two and three. Uh, the topics were both uh, about. So, for example, I've written my online tickets, or I upload a file. Um, this option is given by you, uh, given to you by the teacher, whether to write an online ticket or upload a file. I can simply delete this and go and uh, submit my file. For example, mm -hmm. upload it, and then now my file has been uploaded. That's why I'll go save changes at the bottom. And now submission status draft. So a draft doesn't mean you have submitted. Not submitted. It means you have to take a couple of, uh, of more steps to submit your assignment. That's why, as you can see below there, you have the option of editing or submitting. If you have no more editing, you, you don't want to change anything, you just go to submit assignment again. So you see submission status draft not submitted this is not counted by the way you have to go and submit your assignment to be sent to the teacher and to be counted that's why you have this submit assignment down there you click on that one and then are you sure you want to submit your work for grading you will not be able to make any more changes continue click on that one and now submission status submitted for grading now this is counted this is submitted that's why we have no more editing no more submit assignment button there no more options like that there so this is all uh, done by the teacher uh, he or she will give you what type of submission you have uh, but this is the second type that requires a submit uh, assignment button uh, what about the third one uh, for example this one I have prepared for you I'll open it that one this one that requires you uh, click on submit assignment and uh, click on the submission statement so now submission status no attempt that's why I will go add submission submission status no attempt I will go to add submission answer the following questions uh, question number one for example is I have answered online text because I've given all I've been given only the online text option that's why I'll write my answers and then save changes 
Now, submission status, draft, not submitted. This is still not counted. So you have to go down there at the bottom. You have an option of submit assignment. You click on that one. And now, this type of assignment it requires you to read the statement. This is my work, except what I have to acknowledge the use of the work of other people. You have to click on this one and then continue. Click on that one. Now, what is the submission status? Submitted for grading. I have no more options of editing or submitting. So these are the three types of submission. Uh, the first one that requires you just write your answer or your file and uh, save changes and it is done, submitted. The second type uh, that requires you add submission, you add your answer, then you go at the bottom, you click on submit assignment, you save changes and your assignment has been submitted. The third type is that you upload your assignment or you write your uh, assignment, uh, online tickets, you save changes, you go to the bottom again, submit assignment, you click on the uh, submission statement and then it is submitted. And no matter what you do, submission status, you always can check, it should be submitted or submitted for grading. No draft, no attempt. It should always be submitted for grading.